Welcome to our Electrical Engineering YouTube channel. In this video, we will see an example on Equivalent Resistance. To download our Electrical Engineering app, you can visit this website link electrical-engineering.app. This website is especially designed for electrical and electronics engineering students. Question Find equivalent resistance between terminals A and B. Now, here for this circuit, we have to determine its equivalent resistance. Solution First of all, we will take this circuit. Now, here we can clearly see this 1.5 ohm is in series with this 0 0.5 ohm. So, it will be it will be simply 1.5 plus 1.5 plus 0 0.5 it will be simply 2 ohm. Now, similarly, here we can see this is 1 ohm and this 1 ohm they are connected in series. So, it will be 1 plus 1, it will be again 2 ohm. So, what we can do, we can replace these two by 2 ohm and these two by 2 ohm. So, let's replace them. Now, here this will be simply replaced by a single resistance of 2 ohm. It is of 2 ohm and here also this will be replaced by a single resistance of 2 ohm. Now next here we can see this 2 ohm is in parallel with this 12 ohm. So let's solve this 2 ohm parallel with Let's take different color. So, 2 ohm parallel with 12 ohm. It will be 2 into 12 divided by 2 plus 12. Now, if we solve this, we get 2 into 12 divided by 2 plus 12. Now, this is 12 by 7. 12 divided by 7 ohm and here this 6 ohm parallel with 2 ohm. So, 6 ohm parallel with 2 ohm it will be 6 into 2 divided by 6 plus 2. So, 6 into 2 divided by 6 plus 2. It is simply 3 by 2 or we can write 1.5 ohm. Now, here we are keeping this fraction to get the precise answer. So, now next step, we can copy this circuit from here. And now, we can replace these two resistances with a single resistance of 12 by 7 ohm. So, it will be simply 12 by 7 ohm and this 6 ohm parallel with 2 ohm, this will be replaced by 1.5 ohm. So, now here it will be replaced by 1.5 ohm. It will be 1.5 ohm. Now, here we can see this 8 ohm is in parallel with this 2 ohm. So, let's solve this 8 ohm parallel with 2 ohm, it will be 8 into 2 divided by 8 plus 2. So, 8 into 2 divided by 8 plus 2. So, it is 1.6 1.6 ohm. Now, similarly, this 4 ohm parallel with this 6 ohm. So, here we can write 4 ohm parallel with 6 ohm. So, 4 into 6 divided by 4 plus 6. Now, if we solve this, we get 4 into 6 divided by 4 plus 6. It is simply 2.4 ohm. 
So now we can copy this circuit from here. And now we can replace 8 ohm parallel with 2 ohm with a single resistance of 1.5 ohm. It will be replaced by single resistance of 1.6 ohm. So 1.6 ohm. And here this 4 ohm parallel with 6 ohm. This will be replaced by 2.4 ohm. it will be 2.4 ohm. Now here we can clearly see this 1.6 ohm is in series with 2.4 ohm. So what we can do? We can add them 1.6 plus 2.4. So 1.6 plus 2.4 is 4. So it will be 4 ohm. Now again we can copy this circuit from here. Now we can replace these two resistances by a single resistance of 4 ohm. So it will be of simply 4 ohm. Now here we can clearly see all the resistances are connected in parallel. So therefore 1 upon RAB is equal to 1 upon 12 by 7. 12 divided by 7 plus 1 upon 4 plus 1 upon 1 1.5. Now, if we solve this in calculator, it will be 1 upon 12 by 7, then plus 1 upon 4, then plus 1 upon 1 1.5. So it will be 3 by 2. 3 divided by 2 is the value of 1 upon RAB is equal to 3 upon 2. So therefore RAB is equal to 2 divided by 3. And since it is resistance, so its unit will be ohm. So this is how we can find the value of equivalent resistance. To download notes, MCQs and much more you can visit this website link electrical-engineering.app. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe to this channel. And thanks for watching.